Deep in winter, the freezing temperatures make midday sunshine more valuable. The Francois monkeys sit on the cliff in family groups. The rainforest's most agile and smart creatures are enjoying the most relaxing hours of their day. A diet largely composed of tree leaves and a solid black coat explain the name of the primate in Chinese. But not all of these monkeys live up to their names. Some have been born with a difference. This female albino Francoise monkey was first spotted in 2017 in Encheng National Nature Reserve during a field survey. The body color has earned it the name Little White. It's not the first time that an albino has been discovered in the wild. For millennia, albino Francoise monkeys have been sighted in this stretch of karst forest. They were known as white monkeys. Their histories date back to the ancient classic of mountains and rivers, where albino primates in the wilderness were recorded. They were regarded in ancient times as the embodiment of wisdom and intelligence. In later legends and folklore, they became an object of admiration. Actually, albino animals are the result of a genetic pigmentation defect. This genetic abnormality is widely found in the natural world. Although it has no adverse effect on the body's functions, the distinctive color can be a major inconvenience for any wildlife species To merge into the surroundings, a dark coat of hair would be natural camouflage. It helps the Francoise monkeys blend into the shady forests. The snow white exterior, in contrast, only sets the animal apart in the foliage. The lack of protective colors can leave an albino exposed to the predator's gaze and even put the whole family in danger. Other members of the family, however, never discriminate on account of this against Little White. Living in the formidable terrain of the karst forests, the Francoise monkeys set up home on the precipitous cliffs. Here, the limestone eroded by rushing water presents an array of caverns, allowing the monkeys to roam freely and with ease. The lay of the land has greatly reduced the risks posed by the family's albino member. They all have faith in their mutual support and cooperation. In this dense woodland, this is the most potent weapon of survival.